Well, you guys, I am so flipping excited. I, this is a rhetorical question because I'm assuming the answer is going to be yes. Who would like to have a September sales blow the doors off of any other previous month you've ever had in Mary Kay? Like bigger than bigger than big, like unbelievably big. So I'm just going to assume you all are shaking your heads going, yeah, that's me. Pick me, pick me. So I'm going to share with you guys a couple things. First of all, many of you are working on your star. So when you get off this call, if you don't know how much you have in left to finish your star, please text your director today and say exactly how much do I need to finish my star? Because you all should know. Now, if you did PCP enrollment or you were a star consultant, then you can order several things today. What you can order is all the false sparkle stuff. And let me just screen share a few of these things with you. So you can order everything on here. You can... Um, you can order the, the sparkle highlighters, the sparkle lipsticks. You can order every single thing on here. I will tell you the two things that you need to have in mind, the three things that probably will sell out within the next two weeks are going to be, well, of course, the face towel, but the, both the sparkle lipsticks, especially the liquid shadows and the highlighter powders, especially the more the rose sapphire one. I didn't check on the nail polishes, but because of price point and the sparkle and how great they are, the eyeshadows are selling fastest as well as the highlighters. So if you want those, I would just make sure those go on your star order because chances are if you go to order those in two weeks, they're going to not be available. So just kind of FYI on that. So yes, you can use any of that for your to help finish your star. Um, but what else you can also use to finish your star is you can use the new holiday. So this is for the people, excuse me, I have hiccups. This is for the people who did either PCP, which is customer enroll, you know, sending the catalogs out, or if you were a star last quarter. <clears throat> Everything I'm about to show you, you can order today. However, I'm preempting that. However, in huge, huge letters, you may want to wait until the 15th or do two orders. So let me walk you through that. So here's what's available to all of you who did PCP or were a star last quarter. And if you aren't sure if, if you're in one of those categories, text your director and say, am I an order early person? What you are able to order is the Fanorama Mascara, which is a regular line item. So if you're looking at where to spend your money, I might get a few, but I wouldn't necessarily have to get bulk of this because I think there's other things that are going to sell out. Okay, so let's look at this metallic liner. This is going to be hugely, hugely popular, hugely popular. Part of the reason is the price point. It's 12 bucks. It's the world's greatest stocking stuffer, right? It's going to be huge, but I want to screen share something else with you guys, and I'm going to go to speaker view so you guys can see this big. So I'm going to hold up. This, this is the new holiday lookbook. Look at her eyes. She has the copper liner on which looks absolutely stunning on her. And then inside here, you have got two women. Um, first of all, here's the tip. So the tip is, I don't want to say it's idiot proof, but I can draw these lines really, really well because it's a foam tip and it comes in the bronze and the silver. And here it is. There it is on her on bronze. And here it is in the silver. These are going to be huge, you guys. I'm betting within and don't hold me to this because I always feel bad if things sell out faster than what I tell you. I don't want you to go, well, you said they were going to last 10 days and they only lasted three. But I'm going to tell you, there's going to be, those will be very, very early sellout on both of those. Again, it's the price point and it's what they are. They're trendy, they're fun, they're cute. Those are available as of today. Um, but keep in mind, not everybody can order today. So I don't think they're going to sell out by the 15th, but they will sell out quick. Eyelash curler is good. Is it going to sell out fast? I don't think so. So I think if you're kind of deciding where to spend your money, you could always get a, get one to show or whatever the lip shine sets i think i will sell these but not the volume that i will sell of the metallic liner so you have to know what you love because i will sell what i love right these are a matte and shine so this is a matte lipstick with the oil on top so it lasts a little longer so these are great again fun holiday thing 28 dollars price point so it's a little more expensive for a stocking stuffer but possible but those so all these four items are available today on the early order offer now, the fragrances are not. The fragrances, we still have a packaging issue. We can't get them. When they do come in, I will tell you the men's is going to sell out in record time. Why? One, because we have nothing else for the men for holidays. <laughs> Number two is it's a great price point. It's a perfect stocking stuffer, and it's three of our hottest sellers. Cityscape, High Intensity Cologne, High Intensity Sport. I highly suggest each and every one of you get one for you. Why? As a tester. Perfect, because then you can start spraying tissue and saying, which, which of these would drive you crazy? Because if a man knows it drives his woman crazy, he'll wear it. So 
just so you know, so this is going to be the men's set. When there's a when they will be available, we have no idea. So we're, you're on a need to know. We'll let you know as soon as we know. All right. But these you cannot get today. This highlighting stick and rose you can get today. I don't think that's going to sell out immediately, but it might. But I, I wouldn't pick that as my top three. The boxes are great. The boxes are very inexpensive. These are a section one item, surprisingly. So these are going to be huge. And then, of course, the big announcement. Okay, there's two big announcements. <clears throat> the first is the Mint Bliss with the socks. <clears throat> super, super cute. I'm going to show you a better picture. If you look in the back of the, oh, shoot, it's the wrong lookbook. Um, Kevin, can you find me my other one of these? Um, I had it right here. It's another one. Oh, sorry, guys. Never mind. Figures on. I got it. Okay. So notice these socks, though they are burgundy with a pink stripe and a dark charcoal gray stripe. The socks, gang, are free. So you get a pair of socks with every mint bliss for the leg energizer. Okay. So for eleven dollars, when a person buys it, they get the lotion and the free socks. So let's talk a little bit about strategy. And I'm going to come back to that, but I have to unveil the big thing, right? Okay. So what I'm absolutely to die for, the most excited, like flipping out over is something that they brought back. So I'm going to screen share a picture and you guys are going to just die. This is called the 12 Days of Faves. It is a beautiful sleeve over a box. It is burgundy and gold. This is what it looks like. When they open the hinge doors, there are 12 boxes inside. One looks like a book. I think these are just so cute, so clever. Each one of these has product in it. And so you literally sell this as a set. Does that make sense? So now some of you might be thinking, oh my gosh, so excited. That's going to be hot. What's in it? So let me share with you what's in it. It's a little different than last year. Um, can somebody just give me a thumbs up if you can see the list of the 12 days of faves? Can you actually see the list of what's in it? Or only the picture? Oh, thank you, Gloria. I can okay. only see the picture. You can only see the picture? Okay, hold on. Then I got to just go back and screen share again. Okay, so here's what's in it. This is, and this will all be posted on our unit Facebook page, so you don't necessarily have to jot this down, but it has a full-size mascara, a full-size lip gloss, full-size primer, full-size lip balm, full-size liner, black, full-size cream eyeshadow and light beam, which looks good on every skin tone, and full-size charcoal mask. Now, if you add these up, it's 113 retail. That you might want to jot down. It's 113 retail. Then they're going to include five special things, a, a pack of hydrogel eye patches. Y'all know what that is. It's a foil sample that has a set inside. Revealing Radiance Facial Peel Sample. A complete set of the lip gloss deluxe mini. So it's all six little mini lip glosses, which I'll show you in just a second. A mini eye makeup remover, as well as a mini set of microdermabrasion. So I'll show all those to you in just a second. So if you look at our cost for this, and I know it's not retail, but if you look at our cost of this and the retail of this, so this up top is 113 and our cost down here is 1450, it's roughly worth at least 127. 127.50 somewhere. That's just our cost on the section too. But you know that those gifts are worth a little more than that. So I would let them know they're getting a great deal and you're going to sell these for 99. And you do not need to discount them. You guys do not feel like you guys need to discount them. They get that box and all the inside boxes for free. And if the guy's smart or whoever got it is smart, they keep it and they can fill it with other goodies the following year, like cookies or candy or something. All right. So let's wrap our heads around this. So everybody now sees what's in it. And you can also see the picture of what comes, what it looks like. So I'm going to go back. Um, can somebody say, give me a thumb? Uh, well, it's all, it's all good. All right. So let me show with you guys. Now, this is an empty one from last year. I saved the box because I had it as a display kind of thing. So this is last year. So the packaging looks a little bit different, but see how the top slides off. And when you guys shoot your own video of this, people are just going to have a come apart. Trust me. Now on the back of the lid, I don't know if this year's is going to be like that, but I assume on the back of the lid is a list of everything that's in it. What I love about what they chose is it's all popular. Doesn't matter whether she's 20 or 65. It doesn't matter whether she's ivory skin, ebony. It doesn't matter. These products are going to be amazing on everybody. Full-size mascara, full-size light beam, like everyone's going to love those. Absolutely. I'm glad they took out the lipstick and they put a full-size mascara in instead because not everyone wears lipstick. All right. So again, just like this upcoming one, this is what last year's looked like. And remember, although I like the boxes of even this year, even better, each one had a something in it. Now, 
I will tell you, there's going to be a whole different training on what, how to doctor this up a little bit. For an example, on, a, on mine, when they buy them, I'm going to add this beautiful washcloth. The beautiful washcloth is a section two item. I know it doesn't count toward my star, but I'm having my girlfriend who's like Martha Stewart. She's going to figure out how to make this either look like a rose or like a flower or something so that I can tie this with the word beautiful showing. I'm going to somehow figure out how to put this on the outside of the box. That's kind of my goal. I could always put it on the inside, but I'm going to add this as a little tuck in extra. You don't have to, but just throwing that out there. All right. These are going to be huge. Now, let me go back and share with you guys. I'm going to go back to gallery view here just so I can see everybody. Um, so let's talk a little bit about this, you guys. What's really important is what you guys do over the next four or five days. Now, these are all available on the 15th of the month. Now, unlike last year, last year they limited everybody in the entire sales force to 10. And the company sold out in 48 hours. Now, my first call to the company was, who in the heck forecasts for you? Because they said, Diane, we doubled our estimate. We took our estimate. We thought it's COVID, blah, blah, blah. So we doubled our estimate and we went a little more than double our estimate. And I said, well, I hope if you ever bring these back, you more than quadruple whatever number you're coming up with, because we could have sold these. Now, the good news is they brought them back. Here's the news I'm going to kind of warn you guys on. They're not limiting them. So instead of giving us all 10, people like me will probably order 30. And I know some of you are going, but that's not fair to people who can only get five. It's like, you know what? The floodgates will open on the 15th and we're going to see what happens. So if you are trying to finish your star, this is a great way to do it. So I want you to grab a piece of paper because I'm going to give you some strategy. I'm really good at this part because last year I kicked butt with this stuff. Now, I know that's not very professional. Sorry, this is on a video. All right. So let's talk about this. Okay. Let's talk about the mint bliss first. It's a great package. What I do on mine is inside here, I put a certificate that said, this entitles you to a pampering session for the new year. I said, it's worth $10. Did I charge them for it? No, it was free. So I didn't even ask them. I put it inside every single one of these boxes. I put my sticker on the product. And then I put inside here, a certificate for a pampering session and $10 that expires on January 31st. Now, if they buy a gift certificate, you can't put an expiration. But if you give them a gift certificate, it can have an expiration date. And it had my contact info. Okay. And let me tell you why I did that. I last year sold over 80 of these, eight zero. How did I sell that many? I, this, was my, this was my strategy. So jot this down. These are some things you guys are going to want to jot down. Number one is teachers. So you go to a principal and you say, because teachers right now are going to be appreciated at a whole new level after COVID, right? So let's say you go to a principal, could be somebody even that owns a daycare center. They want to get it for all their workers. Their price point for, for a gift is not going to be 25 or 30 or $35 if they have a staff. 11, they can do. And if they get free socks, it makes a great impression. When you wrap this, and I can give you ideas to wrap later, but when you can say to somebody who owns a daycare who says they have, let's say, four employees and say, oh my gosh, how would you like to get a really special gift for $11 each? They're like, are you kidding? I'll take four. So what I had happened last year is I have a gal who owns a senior care agency and she had 21 caregivers, some very part-time, some full-time, but 21 on her staff. She ordered one for every one of them. She goes, can I get 21? I said, absolutely. Now I ordered 30, right at my very first order. And so when she said she wanted 21, I went, wow, I don't have very many left. So then I went online, I ordered 40 more. And so you get 40 of these and a lot of socks. All right, so then let me also give you some ideas. So teachers would be great. Also for parents buying for the teacher. So let's say your kid's in seventh or eighth grade and they have four or five teachers. This is like a personal appreciation kind of thing, like self-care. And that's really what, what parents want to do is self-care for the teachers, not buying them candy or Apple stuff or whatever. So this is self-care. So teachers are great. Another place to do this is bankers that have a staff. So if you have a branch manager and you know a branch manager, they may want to buy one of these for everyone that is there, male or female. So that's another one. Um, care agencies I mentioned, also a nursing home. Now I'm not talking like the big 300 or 400 person facility, although they might, they might get it just for their caregivers, especially if you find a facility that has between, I'd say 20 to maybe 75 residents, you know, with the small boarding cares are bigger, they're gonna have a staff of caregivers. And again, because of the price point, when you can get something as cute as this. So I would take the lookbook that you guys can all order as of today or on the 15th, order these because even if you don't have your socks yet, you can show them this beautiful picture on the back of the cute socks with the mint bliss. And of course, 
crack one open because when they smell this, when they sell the smell the mint in this, it's great for neuropathy. It helps with circulation. If you guys are not sold on this product, try it. So this is going to be huge. Another great place I sold several of these last year was a dental office. So I went to my dentist and he said, I want to get two. I said, so tell me what your holiday gift buying is looking like. And he said, I need two bigger gifts. And then I need seven smaller gifts. I said, what's your price point? He goes for the bigger gifts, probably between, he said, I don't know, 75 to hundred. He said, and for the smaller gift, I'd like to keep it around 20. So when I showed him this for 11, he goes, those are 11. He goes, I'll take seven of those. And I said, and then I sold him the 12 days of faves for the two office people. So the managers of his dental office got the two 12 days of faves and everyone else in the staff got these. But again, it's about volume, right? You're not having, some people will buy just one of this and one of that, but I'm saying in general, I had a lot of moms see this last year and they're like, between my two kids, I need six teacher gifts. I said, great, you want to get six? And they said, yes, please. Then I was concerned that I wasn't going to be able to get the socks. So those are just some ideas for Mint Bliss. And then I'm going to give you some ideas for the 12 days of phase and then I'll open it up to questions. Okay, so this is going to be big and I know the socks will sell out, but I don't think they're going to sell out as fast as the 12 days of phase. All right, so let's talk about this box. So first of all, you definitely want to have one to, to show. Now, I know you don't have one. So what I did last year, because I didn't have one either, is I took the picture that I'm going to post on our unit Facebook page. I printed it out and blew it up to eight and a half by 11. So I, I literally had it on a piece of like, you know, like a piece of cardstock in a plastic sleeve. So it looked pretty. And on the back of it, I had the list of the product. And then I literally had, um, I literally took the lookbook and I cut out the pictures. I know you're going to think this is silly, but sometimes people are visual. So like I took this mascara and I cut that out or I took the, the shadow and I cut that picture out. If you want to, you don't have to be this detailed. Um, but until I physically got one. So I put some of the products that are on there. And I started talking to people and I would say to people, oh my gosh, this, this amazing box is coming out. Now, here's a couple things. I'm going to give you a list and this is not completely inclusive of all possibilities, but this is what I did. So last year they limited us to 10. I had, you can sell those 10 in a matter of a couple of days, but now you're able to get more than 10. So you want to be really, really strategic on this. So my personal challenge to each and every one of you on here, even if you're super part-time is to sell 10 by the 15th, minimum five. I know you all can sell five, like hands down, but the goal would be to sell 10 at you know, $99 each and let them know you're tucking in extra goodies inside there. All right, so let's talk about how, to, how did I sell so many so fast last year? So first of all, I went to some of the men that I know. So I'm not discounting the women gift buyers. I'm just focusing on men for just a minute. So men in these industries, insurance, men in real estate, jot these down, chiropractors, dentists, and doctors, accountants, contractors, and attorneys. Now, again, that's not inclusive. I'm just throwing those out. So insurance, real estate, chiropractor, dentist, doctors, accountants, contractors, and attorneys. So here's what happened. I went to the guy who, I, who has my lake house insurance. And I said to him, hey, Kevin, I said, you are going to flip out. I said, do you get gifts for your, for your staff? He goes, I do. And I said, well, before you tell me what you do, can I share something with you? And I was this excited. And I think that's part of what gets them excited. I said, how would you like to get? So I said, how many people on your staff do you buy for? He said, two. He goes, I've got an office manager and then a head underwriter. I said, do you normally give them the same thing? And he goes, yeah, because they share the office. So I can't really give one a better gift than the other. I said, okay. And I said, what's, what's your budget? And he said, oh, it depends, somewhere between 50 and 100. So I, as I'm hearing that, I'm thinking, okay, that's on the lower end, but that's fine. And I said, what if you could give them a gift that not only blows them away, but they talk about it for months to come? And he goes, I'm all ears. And he's a very like even keel kind of personality. And I, I had him on a Zoom thing and I pull this out and I show him this. I take the sleeve off and I go, now check this out. I said, not only are all the goodies in the back, and I, so I'm romancing this and I'm sliding this off. And I said, Kevin, are you ready for this? I go, can you imagine your office manager when they open this? Oh my gosh, they can start unwrapping things on the 13th of December, all the way to the day of Christmas. They can wait till the day of Christmas and open one every hour. They can have a heyday with this. And I said, everything in here comes hundred percent satisfaction guarantee. So I'll call them right after the holidays and see, is there anything in there you want to exchange? Anything at all. And anything they want to exchange, I, I exchange it for them at absolutely no cost. I said, and I'm going to include a gift certificate in there for an additional pampering and I'm going to tuck in extras. And I said, now, Kevin, I was limited to 10 and I can't get any more. They've already sold out. 
are you interested? He goes, actually, he goes, I definitely want to for the office. He goes, but I'm thinking my wife would really like that. And I said, okay. And he goes, she's not really a makeup girl, but she's really into skincare. And he goes, it looks like there's a lot of skincare stuff in there. And he goes, I think I want to get her one too. I said, okay. And he goes, well, actually, so then he paused for a second. He says, well, what about for like, t- like my daughter? And I said, well, how old is your daughter? He said, 24. And I said, oh, trust me, your daughter, if your daughter sees that your wife got one, she's going to go, dad, how come you didn't get me one? And he goes, well, that's what I was thinking. And he goes, and she's very into the little boxes and all that. He goes, okay, so I'll take four. I said, okay, great. I said, so all I need, Kevin, is I need a 50% deposit, the rest on delivery. And he said, I'm going to put it on the credit card. So I don't care. I'll just pay you all in full right now. I said, okay, now I'd rather have him pay me in Venmo or Zelle, but so for my first phone call, four sold, that's $400. You guys get excited. Then I said to Kevin, do you know of any other people in insurance that you think would love this? And he, she, he says, actually, I have a colleague that's out in Antioch. Um, I can give you his name. And he goes, I have no idea what he does for gifts, but you might want to mention it to him. And I didn't, he wasn't interested. He's doing his own thing. All right. So anyway, um, sorry about that. So, okay. So, so men and insurance. So then I went to a real estate agent and I said the same thing. And I, it's a guy. And I said, do you have anybody in the office you buy gifts for? He goes, yeah, I usually buy him wine. And I said, okay. So, um, I said, well, would you consider doing something more intimate or more, more personal? I said, you know, it's all about self-care. You guys can really play up on the self-care because of what's in the box. Right. So anyway, so I went to the real estate agent. He bought one for his actual office manager. Then I went to my chiropractor and I said, do you think this is something your wife would like? And he said, actually, I want to get one for my wife and one for Jenna, my daughter, who's 30. So I sold him two. All right. My dentist, he bought one for his wife, but everybody else in the office, he did the um, he bought two of these for the office staff and all the rest he gave um, the mint bliss to. Same thing with accountants, chiropractors. Now, when you deal with contractors, remember contractors this year have made a ton of money. So have realtors, and they sometimes have people who've jumped through hoops. Like one of the realtors that bought for me last year, it was a female realtor. She bought for, uh, she has four on her, she sells estates. So she sells big, big high-end houses. So she bought four for the women on her staff but then she said, what do you have that's about $30? Because she says, I have four or five women or people that really jump through hoops. Like I needed an inspection right away or I needed an appraiser right away. So Wendy got five of these for her staff, I think four or five, I can't remember, for her staff, right? And then she, I showed her this, but it wasn't enough of what she wanted. So she ended up getting satin hands. So I got four sets of satin hands for her. So her, her purchase was over $800 just to one realtor. All right. So remember also with contractors, with men, keep in mind, if the men buy these for their staff, ask them when they're done, because your whole men mindset is I want to take care of your executive gift buying. But when he says, oh yeah, I'll take one. Say, what about for somebody in your personal life, like a wife or a girlfriend or a daughter? And he might go, oh man. I said, because trust me, this is a gift they'll be talking about for a long time. They might even give you the boxes back for their birthday and say, fill them up again. All right, so now let's talk about women. When you sell to women, one of the things that you wanna do is you want to gear the women um, to, they're gonna possibly be buying for their mom. And again, I'm thinking either Mint Bliss or the 12 Days of Faith. So they could be thinking of stocking stubbers for their mom. This could go in her stocking with her socks. This could go under the tree for mom, right? She might, but the mom, woman is also buying possibly for sisters and daughters daughter-in-laws, sister-in-laws, and she, for herself, every time a woman bought one, I said, like I said to Wendy, I go, Wendy, do you want one? And she goes, I do. I said, do you want me to add it to your real estate budget? Do you want your husband to get it? She goes, I want my husband to get it. I said, that's fine. I'll text him because she, she knew what was going to be in it, but she still wanted one for her. Does that make sense? So remember when you're dealing with women, you're asking them, do you have a mom or a mother-in-law, a sister or sister-in-law, daughter or daughter-in-law, And is that something you'd love under the tree for you? Okay, because one woman could say, yeah, I want one for my daughter, my daughter-in-law. In In fact, Sharon Varner bought, she has one daughter and two daughter-in-law. So she bought three from me at 99 bucks a pop. And last year, I literally, I was trading consultants with any what they would part with. (laughs) That's how I got 19 of them. All right. So the next thing I want to think about when you're thinking about this is who do you know who's got a wedding in the next three months? What bride? 
Do you guys know how brides love to give their bridal party something that's going to have a huge impact on them? Well, what if the bride could give them this for being in her bridal party? Can you imagine if you were in the bridal party getting all of this? Now, it's not the same. This is last year, so I don't want to confuse anybody. It's not this list. But this year's packaging, can you imagine a bride getting that? Or maybe she'll get it just for her maid of honor, but she might get it for her whole wedding party. So who do you know who's planning a wedding? That would be a killer gift. And then on the flip side of that, how about for the bride? So who's got a bridal shower coming up that doesn't know what to get the bride? Maybe you get her a gift card at wherever she's registered for um, her dishes or whatever. And then you could get her this. And then the last one is baby shower. Who do you know who's having a baby shower in September, October, November that would absolutely love? I would love to call the mom of the, the, soon, to be, the soon to be grandma, right? The mom of the, of the woman expecting and say to the mom, would you love to give this to your daughter at her baby shower? And she might go, oh my God, my daughter would flip out. It's all personal care. She would love this, right? So it could be bridal shower, baby shower, women for their personal gift giving. And then of course, when I gave you all those industries, then I want you to go back and think of all the women you know in insurance, the women in real estate, because my realtor, the female, she's not my realtor. She's not even, she's never even listed a house for me, but she buys a lot of product from me. She's the one who spent $800 with me last year. So women in real estate, female chiropractors, female dentists and doctors, female accountants, female contractors, and female attorneys. Anybody who might possibly have a staff. Now, it might be somebody who owns a restaurant because restaurants right now, this kind of a thing would be great for restaurants. Why? Low price point. People that are on their feet all day and all night, this is the product they love to buy because it's the mint bliss. It helps. In fact, Teachers, nurses, and people who work in restaurants are my three biggest customers that love this because it helps tired and, and achy feet. So just to answer your questions, are the socks and the mint bliss available on the 15th? Yes, and there's no limit. So if you order today and you have early ordering privileges, you can get all the stuff we talked about. You can get the liners. You can get the um, so you can get these liners. You can also get these lip kits. You can get no perfumes yet, but then you can also get um, the um, Fanorama mascara, the eyelash curler, those things you can get. What you can't get are the socks and this. Well, the, this year's version of this. Those you have to wait till the 15th. So what I would do if it were me is I would look at where you are for your star and look at what you have to finish. If you've got 800 left to finish, all you've got to do is pre-sell eight of these and you've got all the cash to do your order. That's going to give you $800. So hopefully they'll all pay you in full. They only pay you in half. You guys can all figure that out. All right, so I'm going to tell you guys, mark my word, last year, 48 hours, and that's when they limited everybody to 10. Why they're doing no limits this year, I don't know. I think it's a little, I'm fine with that, but I think they're a little crazy. So this has no limits with the free socks until the socks sell out, of course, and then the 12 days of faves. All right, so I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited too, and I hope you love these ideas.